Good evening and welcome ahead of what should be a pulsating night of football. I'm Derek Ray, joined for commentary by former England international Lee Dixon, and we've got UEFA Champions League group stage action to bring you tonight. It's Paris Saint-Germain up against Roma. Yeah, the long road to the final starts here in game one. Always think that if you win your home games and don't lose your away games, you've got a good chance of progressing. Here is the initial 11 for Paris Saint-Germain. The evergreen Gianluigi Buffon begins in goal. Thiago Silva plays alongside Marquinhos in central defence. Marco Verratti starts alongside Adria Rabio in the centre of the park. And the main striker today is Edinson Cavani, the Uruguayan. Interesting to compare and contrast PSG now with PSG a few years ago. Lee, you played against them at a pretty big contest before the big money came in. Yeah, this semi-final in 94, the Cup Winners' Cup, they had a few good players. They had the one exceptional one in David Ginola, and guess whose job it was to mark him? That'll be mine. Fortunately, I came out on top. Well, the team did, and we got to the final. This, the Roma starting 11. And they are a team, Lee, known for their aggressive high pressing. Well, absolutely. That takes a lot of hard work, a lot of organisation, force the opposition to make early passes. The weakness of it, if you beat the high press, you can get exposed at the back. It's the opening match day. Champions League group stage, match day one, underway. This is Neymar. Neymar moving with authority. And options in the center. Not messing around with that clearance. Sheik with it. Kleibert. Well, he first hit the headlines as such an artist with the ball at his feet at a young age, Neymar, and safe to say he's pushed on, Lee. Yeah, I think that's a good description of him, an artist. He does paint pictures on the football pitch. Really brilliant movement. Loves to take defenders on. He's a nightmare to play against, I'm sure. Fazio has it. Pellegrini. In possession, gone at all. It's with Cengiz Under. Kolarov. Here's Kleibert. Lorenzo Pellegrini with it. Dani Alves. Cavani. Dani Alves with it. Neymar. It's with Rabio. A case of foiling the opposition by whatever means. And scope for the cross. And Kylian Mbappe. Rabio. And now Lo Celso. Well, body in the way. In possession, gone on all. El Sharawi has it. And given away. PSG have been in building mode for many a year now and make no mistake Lee the Champions League will be the most coveted prize of all for them to win yeah the opening goal due reward for their efforts well they've made the pressure count they really deserve this lead that one again it's all about the contact does everything right he's not bothered where the goal is he knows where it is he gets a beautiful strike on it and the goal again albeit from a different angle the opening 
goal of the game then. Gone along. Now El Sharawi. In possession, gone along. Roma unable to keep it. Cavani. Mbappe with it. Dani Alves. Here's Mbappe. Verratti. Mbappe. Dani Alves with it. He's in with a chance. Neymar with the goal. Just what you would expect to see from the brilliant Brazilian. Well, you tell youngsters in that position just to hit the target. You can't score unless you do. And on this occasion, he does, and he scores. So, 2-0 now. Gone on all. Sheik with it. It did appear that they might be onto something, but not so. Kurzawa. Neymar. They might see the wide route as a fruitful one, PSG. Pellegrini. Verratti now. Well, he's got plenty of space on the flank here. And a half-baked clearance. They have the sixth sense to know what to do and win it back. Verratti now, it's been slipped through by Marco Verratti, and Neymar, not too fussy in clearing his lines. Well, great read there to intercept. Maxime gone along, oh, a lovely ball. You certainly can't fault them for trying as they keep the pressure on. Well, speculative. Worth an effort. Two goals down, why not? And he's... It's a splendid through ball from Neymar. Rabio, immaculate placement. And fired against the crossbar. Perfect for the Parisians. PSG have scored. Celebrate, young man. Celebrate. It's a brilliant finish. Once upon a time, the officials would have to make a best guess. But now, technology, Lee, clears it up for everyone. Well, absolutely. I need to get one of those referees' watches so I can see it's over the line. But we can see there, clearly over the line. Good decision from the referee. Well, here's a replay. And they always look better when they hit the crossbar. Just look at the power on that. What a great goal, in off the bar. Well, you've got to say, an incredible first half performance. That scoreline tells you. And the whistle is sounded for half-time in this game. Neymar, dynamic, magnetic. Lee, your assessment of his performance. Well, I've got a word for that first half performance. Spectacular. He was absolutely brilliant. He's got his two goals. Let's see what he's got to offer in the second half. The second half commences. It was such a one-sided first half. Might it be different this time round? Veering in field here. Element of risk there, but he's won the ball. Corner awarded. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel change. Clumps clear. Genghis Under. And scope for the cross. Corner coming up. And he's fired over the corner. No nonsense clearance. Not messing around with that clearance. Fazio. Maxime gone along. Mbappe with it. Over the touchline for a throw in. 
Fazio has it. Gone along. Excellent position. Incisive pass from Mbappe. And into the net for PSG. Genius. It really is genius. What a finish. Let's have a look at that again. The keeper thinks he's done enough, but he hasn't. He's just gone past him. He does get a touch on it, though. Well, it has been one-sided, but they deserve the plaudits for the fact that they've kept going and going. Maxime gone along. Cavani. Mbappe with it. Dani Alves with it. Half an hour remaining, then. PSG have decided to make a double substitution. It's with Kolodov. Excellent challenge. Throw in here for PSG. Verratti now. Mbappe. Dani Alves. It's a weighted pass. Now the task is to remain focused. He truly was in a wonderful position, Lee, but he squandered the chance. Well, he went for placement, he didn't go for power, and he's missed it. They will now make use of the substitutes bench. Dzeko. Dzeko. He had the sixth sense to know what to do and win it back. And Patrick Schick now. Crossing opportunity. Maxime gone along. Well, let's see. Does he mean business? Is he going to punish them here? Well, let's see what he has in store for them. And Genghis Under Just wanted to get it out of there. Can they do something positive? Oh, he's through here. Only the keeper to beat. He cuts it back. Straightforward take. Given away. Exquisite pass from Di Maria. And ultimately up a cul-de-sac. Tremendous intuition to win it back. Kleibert. Oh, that's an interesting pass. Well, the bar can be the goalkeeper's best friend. And scope for the cross. That is how to put in a challenge. He's been a bit unfortunate in that the ball has gone out. Genghis Under. Thumps clear. And a corner kick. The referee's verdict. Over it comes. Now well, regaining possession for his side. Cleverly. Fazio. Now, what can he do here? Now, let's see. Does he mean business? It's with Diego Perotti. Is he going to punish them here? Well, let's see what he has in store for them. And a throw in forthcoming. Florenzi on the ball. Teamwork might be the key. And a harmless cross. I think he knew he was guilty of fouling. Free kick conceded. The referee has deemed that to be a bookable offence. Absolutely. Agree with that one. One minute remaining. The electronic board has been held aloft. Two additional minutes here. Given away. Oh, this might pay dividends. Opportunity it is. goes the final whistle the story has been written and told and it's a happy story for the home fans three points for them well when you're assessing the game afterwards there's little boxes to be ticked and they tick nearly all of them tonight the defense the goalkeeper the midfield the forwards look sharp really really easy victory for them tonight clinically from the goal the manager the coaches the players and the fans are all happy tonight